My first poem is called Notes on How to Succeed in New York. Last month in a bar, I talked to a stranger who asked me to put on the heels I had taken off earlier. The stranger told me to put on my heels and walk around so he could watch, and the strangest thing was, I did. This was before I lost the engagement ring, before I crawled on the bar floor, my hands bleeding from broken glass, I kept mistaking for diamonds. My point is move to Brooklyn, be nervous, get married and worried that leaving will mean losing whatever that means. Whales had functional legs. Every day I asked John what he ate for lunch. It's just lunch, but I like to imagine myself there at the table, a sliver of turkey in my mouth, the fork ready for the spinach mashed potatoes. We count our blessings here in Texas. No one is left in the cold. In the other life, I had a room for a home. In the other life, there were never dogs outside my window. Like a portal, a friend says, you've been moved to this. The kitchen table, a woman and her Pomeranian on the lawn, 100 degrees, the floorboards. I'm easily tricked by progress. Change isn't always like clockwork. First one foot and then the next. Or like Christmas, first conception, then extinction. This poem is called The Horses. I've lost one arm to the air and I'm afraid the other is leaving soon. I keep having the same nightmare, a carnival and I'm driving and my brother has died and when I write it down, it becomes the truth. Yesterday was the day I went outside and waved goodbye to all the land that was leaving my family for good. I bought an apple from a stranger, but all I tasted was air, and my mom kept repeating, the dog is upset, the dog is upset. I can't work in the dark, and the horses hate strangers who show their fear. It makes sense to be happy when there's daylight in the barn, but lately I haven't been. I can't explain it or why darkness exists and shadows can look like people who sell fruit in the rain. And I have one last very small poem called Adult Children. Yes, I feel sick about the wasp trapped between the window and the screen, the quiet of worry against the pain, my dad saying, you aren't very social, are you? After a night out, its legs straight up, wings like a snow angel's in the middle of summer. Thank you.